that Toronto Maple Leafs legend who once opened a donut shop couldn't have predicted the latest offering from the chain bearing his name. I can't wait, man. Pizza? That'll be good, right? Tim Horton's Pizza, served hot on flatbread with bacon and other toppings rolling out across Canada, with Tim's promising to install new ovens and to prepare the item in-house. When they add more stuff, uh, too much on the menu, I feel the quality goes down. Plenty has changed since the Hockey Hall of Famer himself opened this location 60 years ago. Now Tim Hortons is making a push to attract more customers later in the day and into the evening. Just ask delivery driver Kathan Parik till what time he typically makes Tim's runs. Usually it's the, just the morning orders we get from Tim Hortons. It's rarely in the afternoon. We get it at a maximum 11.30, then Tim Hortons is dead. The brand's owner faces pressure from some franchisees, complaining of lower than expected profits. But new menu items haven't always gone over well. We know you love your double doubles just the way they are. That's why we've changed things and are giving you something nobody asked for. Consider five years ago those plant-based burgers. And before that, Tim's short-lived beef lasagna casserole. Now comes stiff competition for fast food pizza. We did do a menu reduction exercise before we embarked on launching some of these new platforms and new products. Uh, and also we sort of have a rule of one in, one out. McDonald's Canada famously tried serving pizza, but it slowed the drive through line. Tim's insists this won't do that, but. If they're unable to deliver on that quick promise, I think they have some, some potential for risk. It's another break from tradition for a multinational giant that's still considered a donut shop. Thomas Dagg, CBC News, Hamilton, Ontario.